बिन गुरपूरे नही गारे बिन गुरपूरे नही गारे बाबा नान क्या आखे एह विचारे बाबा नान क्या आखे एह विचारे बिन गुरपूरे नाही उदारे बिन गुरपूरे नाही उदारे गुरु प्यारी साथ संगत जी असीस बख्शो ते गाज बाज के फते बुलाओ जी वाहे गुरु जी का खासा वाहे गुरु जी की फते माय नेम इज रोसी कारबेल्स आई एम 8 इयर्स ओल्ड एंड टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू टेलिंग यू अ साखी अबाउट द क्रिएशन ऑफ अन ऑन साइन आई वाज द साखी फ्रॉम दिस बुक and it's called sick nut stories for children volume 1 and this is the sakhi it's called the creation of anand sahib anand sahib is one of the baniya and she the guru granth sahib ji and we do it on happy occasions like weddings or when somebody is born and also on sad occasions when somebody dies there was once this yogi who meditated a lot and ate very less and he also did lots of yoga may he still not find peace and then He heard this great Baba Nanak, who taught everybody to carry the very same light as he did. Another third Guru, Guru Amar Das Ji, said, "Son, Guru Nanak Dev Ji's son. He is just like Guru Nanak Dev Ji. He tells everybody to live a family life and live spiritually, and not go away and live in a cave. He does not care about anybody who claims authority or power over others." The yogi saw divine people's faces look when they talked about Guru Amar Das Ji. The yogi was getting old, so he longed to see Guru Amar Das Ji. And then one day, he set out to go see Guru Amar Das Ji. After showing him great respect, he said, "Oh Guru, ever since I've heard about you, I long to see you. Now I'm blessed to have my yogi." And then the yogi said, "I eat very less, and I meditate a lot, and I also do lots of yoga, but I still do not find peace. Why is that?" And then Guru Amar Das Ji said. Happiness and peace are not found by not eating and trying to be the best yogi. They are found by living a family life and living spiritually and singing God's praises. And then the yogi said, "I am getting old and my life on earth is about to come to an end. So can I be reborn into your family?" And then Guru Amar Das Ji said, "Yes, you shall be reborn into my family. You shall be my grandson." And then the yogi went to the Vyas, where it was very peaceful and beautiful, and said his last prayer to God. Then left his body. The Guru's younger son was named Baba Mori Ji, and when Baba Mori Ji had a son, the Guru sent one of his most beloved Sikhs to go get the baby, because it was the soul of the yogi. Once Guru Amar Das Ji got the yogi, he placed him in his lap and said, "His name will be Anand. Anand means bliss." And then he started singing this beautiful poem, which is now called the Nan Sahib. It inspired everyone and it changed everyone's mood. And he had lots of wisdom and teachings from God, so everybody wanted to hear it. And then a sick climbed onto the rooftop and sang the Nan Sahib to the entire village. A Nan Sahib was created to honor the yogi with all his heart, wanting to be in the Guru's family. The moral of my sakhi is that you are not complete without the true Guru. No matter how many good deeds, seva, pot, yoga, and meditation you do, you are not complete without the true guru, and you are not the true guru sect unless you are a manshak. I feel very joyful and happy when I listen to a nonsan. How do you feel when you listen to a nonsan? Now let's do one part of a nonsan together. Ram kiya mala ti janan ekun kar sat kar prasad. नान प्यामी माए सात गुरु मैं पाया सत्य तो पाया सहज चेती मन भरी आवाज आईया राग रतन परवार पईया सब गाव में आईया सब दोता गाव हरी के रमन जिनी बसाए के नानक आनंद हुआ सत गुरु मैं पाया वाहेगुरु जी का खालसा वाहेगुरु जी की फतेह